My name is Guy Kester, I'm a professional bag tester. Been doing it quarter of a century and I've got hair like Uncle Fester. What on earth is happening? Don't worry, I'm not going entirely mad. Today is new rap day from PT's. To be specific, the Holdfast Trail Tool Wrap. So, what is it? What's my involvement with it? What can you put in it? And how does it go on your bike? All fascinating and very clever things. So first up, uh, I do some consultancy work for PTs. Uh, I did it on, uh, they got me on board to help stab tires with various uh, sealants to see which worked the best. And I've been working with them on this wrap for a while as well. So we've got all sorts of uh, mock-ups here. We've got one with a fidlock uh, setting to uh, work with their bottles. We've got hand stitch prototypes from Bryn the designer. He uh, even, even got his sewing machine license for uh, this project. But finally, after working through loads of those, we have the finished object. So uh, let's take a zoom in on that on the workbench and what it will fit on and then stick them on the bike over there. So first things first, the wrap costs $34.99 in the UK. It comes in green, black or grey but all of them get a colour coordinated wrap strap with reflective detail so you're a bit safer in traffic at night. Now obviously there are loads of wrap straps on the market but because all everything that you put in them is exposed to the elements it gets dirty it gets rusty and it's gritty to use so the idea is this PT's wallet wrap is you've got basically a little wallet like I say uh, with a zipped pocket on the inside and it's all seam welded to make it weatherproof you can put your cash in there uh, your herbs whatever whatever you want to take on the trail with you uh, and you don't want to lose and you don't want to get soggy car keys whatever and then you load up the rest of the pouch with your various vittles for the trail so that's as you can see that's an inflator a mini tool and my uh, PT stabber going in there I find it helps if you give it a bit of a jiggle about and then wrap it all around like that and obviously the tighter you cinch it down the less space it takes up on the mic so you've got a little self-contained pouch there and then you've got the separate strap so how does that work on the bike now to be totally honest it took me an embarrassingly long time to work out exactly how to use this i was doing it all wrong for ages but what you do is this strap here because you've got this soft rubberized section here so it's really grippy on the frame but it won't scratch it at all you put that around and if you're running a tube, you can actually put that in between the strap and the frame, like you would a standard wrap strap. But the clever bit is that this sticks on like that, so your tube stays in place and it doesn't fall off. If you take your pouch off, then you take your pouch, and you literally just stick it on the bottom there, Again, you know, it always works better if you squeeze it together and then just wrap it around there. And now you presto, you've got tube and pouch separately, weather protected. You know, your tools aren't going to get rusty, your cash isn't going to get soggy, your uh, herbs aren't going to be spoiled for your pizza when you finish riding. All of those things, wonderful things will happen, which, you know, you don't get with a standard wrap. And the other genius thing, well, actually, there's a couple. There's a couple of very smart things. So first off, obviously, super quick to get off. And that's the whole point of having freight, having storage on your bike, is it's really quick to rip it off and use it when you want. But you can even dangle it off the bike like that. So it's almost like a little mini workshop on your bike. When you get to gear together, you know, it's not falling on the trail. 
and uh, getting lost in the long grass. But also, and this is a real winner, let's tuck all that back in there. If in the unlikely event your whole shot tubeless plugger doesn't manage to solve your uh, puncture, then you have to take your tube and use it. So you can just cinch that strap down again. And you can still put your hold fast tool wrap with all your tools in back on the bike like that which which you can't do with a normal frame strap you know whatever was under the strap ends up kind of in your pockets or just rattling about which kind of spoils the holy point of having this on frame storage so there you go all your trail essentials ready for use the instant you need them without them getting rusty and dusty in three colours from the lads at PT's. So as always, uh, big thanks to Giro Cycling, obviously PT's products on this one, uh, Enduro Bearings, Torque Nutrition, Crud XL Fenders and Hebtroco for supporting the channel. Massive thanks to my Patreon subscribers who pledge a small monthly amount to uh, give me a sustained income, not just the YouTube, which I think are actually less reliable than uh, getting Bitcoin off the of a bloke down the pub. And they get exclusive early and extended edits as a thank you. So if you really like what I'm doing with the channel, please give uh, subscribing on Patreon a good hard think about. Give this video a like if you'd enjoyed it, click the notifications, click to subscribe. And if I get enough of you doing that, I promise I will never rap on a video again. But I will be rapping on bikes from now on, great mates. Thanks to PT's Hold Fast. Cheers. Cheesy YouTube thumbnail picture.